What's going on? It's CVV, Chris Van Vliet, and you gotta check out Josh Denker's YouTube channel. It's called Josh's Toy Show, and if you love wrestling figures, this is the place to be. He has some incredible reviews there. So Josh's Toy Show, check it out. Hey guys, yes boy, Kit Wilson, Elton Prince, Pretty Deli have arrived in the Elite line for their first ever figures in the Elite line. Hey guys, what's up Josh here, back here with another video, and welcome back guys to another video, welcome back guys to another figure review. Today's figures that we're taking a look at today are the brand new WWE Elite Series 110, Kit Wilson, and Elton Prince, Pretty Deadly. Finally, at long last... We have gotten one of probably the most underrated tag teams in WWE right now. Uh, Kit Wilson and Elton Prince, pretty deadly in the Elite line. I'm such a huge huge fan of these guys. These guys are absolutely talented. Uh, and they deserve better, in my opinion, on WWE TV right now. And here we have their first ever Elites. Before we take a closer look at the figures itself, let's take a closer look at the packaging first. I'm not going to show both. Because uh, they're pretty much the same packaging, just different portraits. So I'm going to start off here with Kit Wilson. Here he is in the box. Comes with a interchangeable head and some interchangeable hands. You can't really see them because they're all the way down in the package. Here's a picture of him on the front. His name on the box there, W Logo. Series 110, Elite Collection. W Logo on the top, name on the side. On the back... You can see his stats. You can pause if you want to read. The other figures in the set. I'm not going to show Elton's uh, box as well because it's pretty much the same box except it just has Elton's picture on it. Um, so the other figures in the set, we have Bruno San Martino. We have Butch, uh, Pete Dunn, um, Elton, Elton Prince, and Kit Wilson, which we're both looking at in this video. Austin Theory, the Tribal Chief, Roman Reigns, and Mommy herself, Rhea Ripley. My most gets from this set are Austin Theory and uh, Rhea Ripley. Uh, I might want to get the Bruno San Martino because I missed out on the Elite 25 uh, years ago. So I definitely want to grab that at some point. Uh, Butch, I might pass on him. I've seen that figure in person. It does look pretty good. I really like the Chase variant more than the uh, regular version. Um, but now since he's back as Pete Dunne, you know, my Pete Dunne uh, figures are kind of current. Um... And Kit Wilson and Elton Prince we're looking at in this video. But yeah, if you guys want to see what uh, Elton Prince's box looks like, it's pretty much the same. They both come with the interchangeable head and the hands. Same thing as the back here, too. Alrighty guys, I will see you guys in the next clip when I get Pretty Deadly out of their box. I'll be right Alrighty guys, here we have Kit Wilson and Elton Prince out of their packaging. And boy guys, these figures look absolutely sick. Mattel did a, an amazing job on these figures. I think these figures turned out great for their first ever elites in the line. I hope we get more Pretty Deadly figures in the future. Before we take a closer look at the figures itself, let's take a closer look at the accessories they come with. Of course, they come with interchangeable heads. Um, 
as you can see here, here's Kit Wilson, here's Elton Prince, and they, this is the uh, interchangeable head when they do that pose on the entrance stage when they um, have the fan blowing in their hair. They they put on this little face. That's pretty cool. I love the head scan. They did a great job with the true effects on this one. Really, really cool. And they both come with a set of interchangeable hands. I'm not going to show them both because they are exactly the same. They come with the gripping hands as well as you can see on the figures. Um, they come with the, uh, posable hands, so you can make them do that, uh, pose, um, when they're on the entrance stage. Uh, so let's take a closer look at the figures. First, starting with Kit Wilson. Alrighty, guys, here are the, here is his face. I really like this face scan on Kit Wilson. Looks really, really cool, just like him. He's got the, uh, usual pretty deadly outfit there. The, uh... The uh, short top here, long sleeves. Love the attire. The attire is really cool. Love the blue. He's got some gold boots on. I really, really like these attires. These look really, really cool. I really like the head scan. Head skin's really great. These are all around just great figures. All right, now let's take a look. Oops. Now let's take a look at Elton Prince. Here's his face. I love this face scan on Elton Prince. This is basically something. This is basically an expression he would make. I really like the way this figure turned out. He's got the same top as Kit, and the same pants, same boots. Pretty much pretty deadly, they dress the same, so you know, everything's the same here, as you can see. Same outfit, same top, and the same boots. So they pretty much dress the same. So there's no, there's no really like differences here. I hope we do get more pretty deadly figures uh, in the future. But if you want my overall honest opinion on these figures, I think for their first ever figures, in the Elite line, they turned out fantastic. Honestly, I highly recommend you guys grab them while you can. Um, they're probably one of the most underrated tag teams in WWE right now. And um, and yeah, definitely get your hands on these figures. Because um, I don't know if we're going to get any more anytime soon. Uh, so definitely grab your hands on these before these become expensive and very hard to find. But if you want my overall honest opinion on how these figures look, I absolutely really think these figures look fantastic they turned out great from the head scans to the attire to the detail and all that other stuff mattel really went all in on these for sure anyhow i will see you guys in the next clip for the outro of this already guys thank you guys so much for watching this video i hope you guys enjoyed comment down below what you guys thought of the elite series 110 pretty deadly figures let me know down below what you guys thought in the comments of the figures and the review down below um, also guys, check the description of this video for all my links down below. Social medias are down below in the description as well. Check them out, follow me, and stay up to date with the videos and what's going on in my life as well, um, outside of YouTube. Um, follow me on all my social medias. Check down below, Instagram, Facebook, all that stuff. Um, check the two new social media links also down below in the description. Um, as well, uh, I have a new wrestling TikTok, at, um, page that I'm going to be posting wrestling content on. Follow me at JDX Wrestling. Check the description for that. Uh, click the link and give me a follow there. I would really appreciate it. And also, check out the official Josh's Toy Show Facebook page down below as well. I'm going to be posting all sorts of stuff up to date with videos like this video you're about to see. And thank you guys for watching. Please like, share, comment, subscribe. I'll see you guys next time. But for now, Josh out. Peace.